Welcome to the Sunday Shave of the Day, Episode 2. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving. And if this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. Alright, now this is Episode 2 of the Sunday Shave of the Day, which means in the description I've got a link there for you to Episode 1, how this shave began if you missed it. Alright, so we started with Parasso Red, and this is the Pre-Shave Cream Excellent Sandalwood Soap. Smell, not really soap, this is Pre-Shave. I'm looking at the soap. So we're using the Art of Shaving, and this is the Sandalwood New Old Stock so this is a tallow base. Now in the description I will have all of the ingredients and the scent profile there for you as well. Now we're going to continue on with my ZY and this is the Grand Slam. This is just a marvelous Chinese razor. Okay, real wood handle, metal spacer, beautiful. I'm going to say that's a half hollow. And look at the fit and finish on that, guys. That is brilliant, right? It really is nice. Okay. Now, we are also using my Omega 10,098 as well for a brush. And let's go ahead and do this. Now, on uh, the first and third Friday of every month, I do shave related videos generally speaking not a shave but uh, shave related so all things to do with shaving so if you guys have any questions or ideas for a Friday special and you would like me to film it go ahead and in the description uh, go ahead and put an idea, put your idea or your question, what you want to see, or how do I do this, and we will do our best to make that happen for you. All right? Sometimes uh, I get some of the great, greatest ideas and questions from you guys. It is really amazing. You guys are awesome as far as, you know, taking care of... business on this channel because really this channel is all about you so the more you interact and the more comments you leave and, and things like that the uh, the better this community is going to be There we go. Now this is episode two, of the Sunday shave of the day, which means this is going to be a pass and a half. We're going to cross the grain on my neck, against the grain on my cheeks, and through here and on my chin. That will be against the grain as well. Again, great soap, great cushion, very slick. Excellent, excellent for straight razors. Be good for any kind of razor though, for that matter.
There we go. We'll see how we did with that. That chin is always a tough part, guys. So, you know, just take your time. Do, uh, do what you can. And you know what? It doesn't have to be perfect. It really doesn't. You know, just, you know, it. all it needs to be is acceptable, especially on the chin. Now you hit a little spot there, no big deal. Switching up that handle, it's just easier for me to hold this way. Just like everything though, Shaving with a, a stray razor in particular, very subjective. You're just going to have to figure it out. You know, for yourself. You know, what works for somebody else may not work for you. Yeah, hit a couple little bumps on the chin, but no big deal. And I've been taking too long. That soap is drying out. So that's what we do. Give it a refresh. No big deal, guys. No big deal. You know, like I say, this is very subjective. Just do what works. It is not a problem. There are no rules, no set rules. As long as you're getting a good shave, I say go for it. Uh, you know, you, the only rules you really have is that kind of like that 30 degree angle, and that's just a rough estimate.
There we go, looking good. Get a few little bumps there around that chin, but no big deal. It'll be fine. There we go. Nice. Nice. All right. Pass two complete. Let's get that washed off. See how we did. Oh, nice. Oh, those cheeks are really good. That always works for me. There we go. All right. Now, the half pass, okay? Here we go. We're going to do the half pass. That is going to primarily be against the grain on my jawline and my neck, okay? Now, again, for you guys, everybody out there is different. So, this is a very subjective experience. You need to figure this out how your beard grows, what works best for you, okay? Because this is all just trial and error, really. And once you get it figured out, you just keep running with it. And then what I would say is uh, just keep doing the same thing over and over and over again. And as you go, you will find ways to get even a better shave. All right, but just keep doing it. Let's keep going. There we go. Nice. That's good. That is really good. Okay. Maybe hit a little bump there.
Oh, nice. There we go. Okay, and we are done. Another shave in the books. Yes, sir. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. Let's get that washed off. See how we did. Nice, nice. Yeah, that's good. That's really good. Okay, definitely. Now, alum everywhere. There we go. Now, we're going to dry that off. And tonight, Simple, easy peasy, okay? Parasso Red, and this is the sandalwood as well, so it's going to all work. And this again is an aftershave and face tonic kind of thing, so it is soothing. Soothing to the skin. All right, there you go. Thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end. Really appreciate you and all you do for me. Click over here to see episode one if you missed it. Click down here on a video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me. Subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.